Okay, you guys have been asking for a long time about a tutorial for how to clean out my paint sprayer. So that's what I'm gonna give you. Normally I do this in my utility sink downstairs, but that is currently under construction and I'm gonna fill you in on all of that when we get there. Um, but for now, we're doing it in my kitchen sink, okay? So I've pulled out all of the dishes <laughs> so that uh, they don't get painted. <laughs> Why would I do them first? Um, anyway, so first thing I do is I rinse. I always, you always keep your gun mostly upright or else you'll get some paint in it. I take this little, this little guy out and I will often have, I usually have a paintbrush or some, some sort of brush that I can get in there. But a, one of these sprayers works too. If you are using a shellac based primer or an oil based paint, you're not going to want to use water. It will clog and ruin your sprayer. You're going to want to use acetone. So it is a little trickier to get it clean that way. Um, then I'll just keep this upright. I'll just take my finger in here and I'll just scrape some of this paint out. This is where the paint comes through to the nozzle. And I'll just get what I can out. The instructions. Say, and I'll also just clean out this tip right here. Push it, clean out the tip. So mine comes with a list little strainer guy and the drain. Rinse all this out. With this lid, these sprayers come with a little teeny tiny hole here. That's how the air escapes. So you always want to make sure you rinse out the paint out of this part too. And these guys are disposable. I usually keep mine and use them for five or so uses before I toss them because they're, they're great. If there's any paint around this rim here, I'll make sure to get that off, otherwise it'll affect the seal. And then I fill this with water, put my lid back on put this in here and you just shake it up and down and that'll get more of the paint out of the top of this this gun and then I rinse it and fill it again I have to I usually will need to plug this in so my sink downstairs has an outlet nearby this one kind of, well first I'm gonna prime so I this turning this down means priming you suck you squeeze all the air out to prime it and then close that guy up, it'll keep it, and then watch what happens. That's Priming it will run the water inside the gun and the pump. I'll just come back through and I'll and I'll get new water and do that process until it's clear. It usually takes me about three times and then it's all clear and don't forget to put this piece back in. 